sponsored by Math Practice with Mrs. Smith. Hey, 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 all you people out there in TV land. I am your host, Glenn Ford, and welcome to Name That Numerator, the equivalent fraction game show for horses. That's right, horses. And our two contestants today are Alice and Steve. Say hello to Alice and Steve. Nice to meet you. Hi. Um, yeah. Hi, Glenn. Nice to meet you. Well, first, let's get started by explaining the rules. You will be shown a pair of equivalent fractions, and you must determine the missing numerator. To find the equivalent fractions, that means the numerator and denominator were multiplied or divided by the same number. For instance, if you multiply the denominator by 3, in this case, 3 times 3 to get 9, then you multiply the numerator by 3. 1 times 3 is 3. 1 third and 3 ninths are equivalent fractions because the numerator and denominator were both multiplied by the same number, in this case, 3. And that's not all. We can also find equivalent fractions by dividing the numerator and denominator by the same number. In this case, we can divide 6 by 2. That will give us 3 for a denominator. And then the numerator we can also divide by 2. 2 divided by 2 is 1. 2 6 and 1 third are equivalent fractions. Thank you, Glenn. I eagerly read the first question. Let's name that numerator. Here are two equivalent fractions. Name the missing numerator. Well, Glenn, I have been studying equivalent fractions for many years now, and I do believe the correct it's five. answer is... That is correct, Steve. The missing numerator is five. Yes. 12 divided by 2 would give us the 6 for the denominator, and 10 divided by 2 will give us 5 for the numerator. 10 twelfths and 5 sixths are equivalent fractions. Here is the next set of equivalent fractions. Name that missing numerator. Oh, good one, Glenn. It reminds me of when I was traveling abroad. It's four. Ah. Correct again, Steve. The missing numerator is Four. To find it, you compare the denominators, and since 6 was multiplied by 2 to get to 12, then you multiply the numerator by the same number. 2 times 2 is 4. When you multiply the numerator and denominator by the same number, you will get an equivalent fraction. Now for the final bonus question. Name that missing numerator. It's nine, it's nine, it's nine. Nine. Is it nine? It is nine. The correct answer is nine. Four times three is 12, and three times three is nine. Three fourths and nine twelfths are equivalent fractions. Good answer, Alice. Thank you, Glenn. I knew all of that time working for the queen would pay off someday, because when I was with the queen, we spent so much time together. We were BFFs, and that is all we have time for. Thank you for joining us here on Name That Numerator. This is Glenn Ford reminding you to like this video and subscribe to Mrs. Smith's math channel, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye, everyone.